Imagine walking into work and finding out your new coworker doesn't ask for a paycheck, doesn't get tired, and can learn your job just by watching you once. Sounds like something out of a sci-fi movie, right? Well, meet Atlas, Boston Dynamics humanoid robot, and it just got a massive brain upgrade. This upgrade isn't about showing off parkour or backflips anymore. Nope. Atlas is now learning how to pick up objects, fold things, organize shelves, and even react when humans try to mess with it. And all of this is happening because of a new system called Large Behavior Models, developed together with Toyota Research Institute. Stick around, because I'm about to break down how this works, and trust me, by the end, you'll see why Atlas just went from a stunt performer to a real worker. So here's the breakthrough. Boston Dynamics and TRI have been building end-to-end -end neural networks that connect everything Atlas sees, feels, and hears directly to the way it moves. Instead of programming each motion step by step, Atlas uses what's called a language condition policy. In plain English, you can literally give Atlas a prompt like, put these parts on the shelf, and it figures out all the walking, crouching, grasping, and balancing needed to get it done. That means Atlas isn't just executing commands anymore. It's learning to handle complex jobs that require its whole body working together. Arms, legs, balance, even how it shifts its weight like a human would. Now, here's where it gets really interesting. Atlas can handle long horizon tasks, jobs that take multiple steps and normally trip up robots. In one test, Atlas had to clear out a cart full of robot parts. First, it grabbed Spot's legs, folded them neatly, and placed them on a shelf. Then, it picked up faceplates and organized them into a bin. And finally, it turned around, cleared another bin full of parts, and dumped them into a tilt cart. All of this was one continuous sequence, with no cuts, no resets, just one policy running the entire show. And when things didn't go as planned, like a lid closing or an object falling to the floor, Atlas adjusted on the fly and kept working. That's the game changer, robots that can recover when things go wrong, just like humans do. But it doesn't stop there. Atlas is now taking on tasks that most robots can't even attempt. We're talking about rope tying, flipping a bar stool, spreading out a tablecloth, or even handling a 22-pound car tire. Think about that. Ropes and cloth are nightmares for robots. They bend, twist, and slip unpredictably. Traditionally, you'd need months of coding for each new object. But with large behavior models, if a human can demonstrate it, Atlas can learn it. It's not just stacking boxes anymore, it's folding clothes, handling flexible materials, and doing things that were once considered impossible for machines. Here's another wild feature. Once Atlas learns a task, engineers can speed it up without retraining it. Because the neural network predicts not just what to do, but when to do it, they can literally turn the dial to double or triple the execution speed. That means Atlas can go from working at human pace to working at superhuman speed, while still keeping balance and accuracy. In tests, speeding Atlas up to nearly two times didn't even affect performance. Picture a coworker who not only learns your job instantly, but can then perform it twice as fast as you, flawlessly. That's Atlas now. Of course, none of this magic happens without data. And the way Boston Dynamics collects that data is honestly genius. They built a VR teleoperation system where a human wears a headset and controls Atlas in real time, moving its arms, crouching, stepping, even opening bins and picking up objects. The VR feed comes straight from Atlas's own cameras, so the operator sees exactly what the robot sees. At first, the system only worked for hand motions, but later they added trackers for the feet, so the operator could literally walk, crouch, and step, and Atlas would copy it perfectly. These demonstrations become the training videos for Atlas's brain. Show Atlas enough examples of folding, stacking, or reacting when something unexpected happens, or, and it learns. Now, collecting data on the real robot is amazing, but it's also expensive and slow. So Boston Dynamics built a simulation system that mirrors Atlas down to the tiniest detail. They can test new tasks, 
gather training data, and even stress test the neural network in simulation before sending it to the real robot. And the best part? The same VR setup, the same policies, the same training code, it all works in simulation and in real life. This lets them train Atlas on thousands of trials virtually, then deploy the polished skills directly to the hardware. So here's where we land. Boston Dynamics and Toyota didn't just make Atlas stronger or faster, they gave it a brain upgrade. One that allows it to watch, learn, and perform complex jobs, sometimes even better than humans. It skipped the Robot Olympics this year, but for good reason. While the world's robots were showing off their moves, Atlas was in training camp, learning how to actually work alongside us. The question now isn't, can Atlas do it? It's, what job do you want it to learn next? Would you trust Atlas in your workplace, or does this future make you a little nervous? Drop your thoughts below, I want to see where you stand. And hey, if this blew your mind as much as mine, hit that like button, subscribe Technology X AI and share it. Because whether you're excited or scared, one thing's clear, Atlas just stepped into a whole new league.